Hey guys, I'm Dorian, and today um, I'm, we're going to discuss ourselves. What if 9.9 megaphones are used at once? Now, no one talking through them, just them on their own, yeah? Screaming to the top of their voices, yeah? With a, a really annoying voice. What could happen? If we imagine, yeah, they were all stuck. They were all together stuck next to each other. Almost just about a millimetre away from each other, yeah? In the air, in the sky. Trying to fit in one whole area as much as they can, yeah? Which could fit like a lot. And they all of a sudden screamed at the same time. One in front of each other, one behind, one's facing other types of ways. Anyway, alright? I'm not talking about one only to face that way in a row that way. Some of them can face like this, and this is cup like this, and like this. Alright? We're talking about that. If in the sky and facing down, facing up and everywhere. And then all of a sudden in three, two, one they start to scream. What would happen in that case? Well, first of all guys, yeah, what could happen if you like the face cam, yeah, I'm using it's really nice in that I can do a fist command if I want to, right? So, um, yeah, right. What could happen? First of all, what could happen, yeah? Is that each type of glass, like this cup, will break because not, like, if you put a voice next to a cup, yeah, like a megaphone, but just imagine they're not big, we have megaphones, not really small, but just a normal sized megaphone. But lots of them around, alright? Or at least enough to fit the entire world stuck together, almost like a millimetre away, alright? Well, even if it's a millimetre, you could actually spread out a little bit. If we'd imagine, yeah, it'll break all the cups, all the glass sinks, because too much sound a very, uh, is going to go very loud, and very loud sound can actually shut a glass. But it's not the sound that it makes, it's not the loudness, it's the voice, the type of annoying voice. So if you put in a, like a knife scraping the glass the, against the glass bottle, yeah, really annoying sound, and then we put like hundreds of them together scraping against, this would have a weak chance, but depends on how thick it is. So, how many megaphones, yeah, screaming would do everything. Your computer screen you're watching right now would shutter, it would go crack. If, even if it's plastic glass, yeah, such as, I can't bring it, but if it's plastic glass, such as, such as uh, this, yeah, which is plastic glass, well, technically, yeah, right, like, technically, yeah, what would happen in that case, in that, the air, yeah, the air molecules would all of a sudden spray against away from each other, revealing something like this. Like if you put lots of this, which is a little bit um, of steam, like this toilet paper right here I have in me. A little bit, um, it's plastic, it's not really plastic, but I like it. It's a tiny bit, a tiny bit, right? Now, continuing next to that point, yeah. What would happen? Next thing that would happen, yeah, is that the sky clouds would all of a sudden come closer together because too much sound can, of course, be so, uh, like, scary. You will break the sound barrier or at a speed that will go so fast. And imagine they talk, they shout, they don't go like, ah, oh, like, ah, loud, quicker and quicker and quicker to top of the, like they can. And let's say that they can shout up to like about um the quickness will be about nine hundred and ninety three kilometers per millisecond. That that sounds crazy, doesn't it? So what could happen? If you imagine yeah, like plastic will never break, alright? It will only about to melt. So like, um, if you put all of it against, like in the sky, the clouds will come down, there'll be less air coming up, there'll be 
there'll be like waves, like waves turning like this, like a whirlpool, football that mega sound. Like it's not just it's not five hundred thousand. It's not a nine it's not seven trillion. I mean that's how they come, but it's nine point ninety nine. So it's it's much more than that. So if you imagine yeah that they can't fit, well imagine they're like touching together. If we imagine yeah, they're also gonna be like some of them are facing each other. So if you think each other creates like a wave. So once they blow in go go I've got it please. So um yeah, so if you imagine yeah all of them used at go make a video I've never made. Silly. Really silly. Yeah. So all of a sudden, yeah, it's created like a, a little wave. Waves used at once, alright? All types of waves, anywhere waves, all used at the same time. I mean, if you create a spiral sound wave for some of the sound is spinning so fast, and the sound from the other ones would automatically go in, and the sound around them would go crazy. If it were to be a voice, yes, yeah, such as mine, like, hey, going through them, yeah, it will sound like as if my voice is going like there and like there at the same time, and all around it was traveling at a kind of thing. But the sound is inside the megaphones. But if you imagine that the sound, yeah, guys, is inside the megaphones, and if you imagine the megaphones, each of these megaphones have a sound when you talk to them, the sound spreads across through lines all around it. Yeah, sound lines. Technically, whatever you're looking at right now, such as your bedroom, would turn all upside down. There'll be things like, such as tornadoes. I mean, that's the air, alright? There'll be like, tornado things, or less gravity, less force. If you check the magnets together, it will be uh, much weaker because it's a sound and um, all the radioactive signals cut out because all the sound is going through them. Now, if you imagine it's all around the world here, yeah, guys, all around the world, spreading and even just a millimeter away from each other, yeah? Facing each other and facing these different way, yeah? And instead of doing like all of them, like instead of having like Several hundred, lots of people, yeah? Lots of people just shouting through the. What if we have just one, uh, phone, yeah? One, uh, speaker, yeah? Connected to all kind of, all of them. And then we shout. Like, all of a sudden. Like, the voice will take some. But if you imagine, yeah, all of them were in different types of voices, the sound you're gonna hear would personally pop your ears up. It's gonna be so loud. So if you imagine one, um, one megaphone can uh, shout at 9.99 trillion percent, yeah? I know that sounds crazy, yeah? That sounds loud. But if we add all of them together, around the entire world, yeah? Around all of the places, all of the countries, even inside the world, I mean, if there's anything such as water would rise and you would be able to control water around. That's because with so much sound, as you know, when you blow... Blow, say if you have a cup of water with you, you know as you usually make yourself a cup of tea then you blow it to make it cool down a little bit. Th that is sound as well, whenever you, you make sound, you're still breathing, and breathing is still blowing. And breathe at the same time. Time. But the megaphones are voices, and if you imagine they use a blowing area at the same time, you could ceremonially make them go all crazy. There'll be glass flying everywhere. Around right now, what you're seeing right now in front of you, yeah? There'll be glass in your eyes around there falling at such a high speed. That speed will be so high that that you could melt plastic. If it was, you could actually melt the glass. So if you were traveling at that high speed, yeah? If you put like a diamond at that high speed, yeah? Like a diamond thing, yeah? That diamond would melt because it's so high speed and it gets so hot. It is 999, 9, yeah, 999 kilometers per 3 milliseconds. Now, a millisecond is crazy, isn't it? Now, I don't know how fast that would be probably to there, to there in a second or something like that. Probably I could get to a country in one second. 
or to a continent in a second or so, split second or something. But that doesn't matter. If I use this phone, yeah, right now, if I use this phone, then call through, the first, but all of a sudden, you think, if the, not the speed, but we're not always talking about the speed, how fast we talk about how far they can travel. So instead of waiting for them to travel only this far and you can't see if you're too far away, we're going to make them travel at um, 999. 999 kilometers away and in less than a millisecond you just reach there all of that reached at once you would imagine how all of these megaphones at once would look like criminally guys what would happen is that this four criteria which split apart and bend. Computer screens, magnets, would vanish and turn into a magnetic field around the area. Which, if you have that field, yeah, all of that, your body would stretch so much like this. You would just so much because of the, of the, of the magnetic field going all crazy around. Because you are going over the sound waves and every sound that is going around the world right now which would be like a powerful force you feel yourself stretched as if two forces are pulling you at the same time and that's kind of what is happening you also created the, the sound force at a sound traveling so quick yeah like all 999 uh, per like, millisecond, which is crazy, even less than that, even a couple of years changing, and lots and lots and lots of different types of voices, yeah, all screaming voices, seeing voices, annoying voices, really annoying, less annoying, all mixed. I mean, if we could imagine, like, the circle, yeah, a circle, you'll be able to turn a sphere, this is very cool, you'll be able to turn a sphere inside out. Without poking the hole, without going through, passing through itself. That's a video I was watching that. Another video I watched on that sphere. But, but, but that's what kind of will happen. Cause so much sound, yeah, make that things such as, such as, what texture is the balloon? Is it plastic? Is it rubber? I'm not really sure, but the top of the balloon is rubber, but if, imagine if it's that texture, alright? Or like a gooey texture. You'll be able to pass through itself because it melts through. Everyone would be able to do things like nothing. If you imagine we take all a megaphone, yeah, but imagine it's not together. I take a megaphone, just keep it away, yeah, then go to my place. Then everyone else takes at least a hundred megaphones. Then it shows it, then, then shuts it. Pretty much nothing would ever happen. We're too far away and the megaphones are not very loud enough. But I'm not talking about loud, they can be loud and they can travel far with the sound. But 999% loud, which would be very loud. Like, there's so much thing that could happen. Like, like, feathers rising in the sky, snow falling down and water at the same time. Millions of rainbows across the sky. So much. But imagine we only uh, shouted per millisecond. That will happen so. If we only shouted per millisecond, yeah? Pretty much, lots of things could still happen. Lots, like I mean, skies, feathers falling. But let's see, if, if you shout it yeah, for three minutes, yeah, and three milliseconds, three minutes and three milliseconds, silly seconds, yeah. Three seconds, all right. Well, technically, you're actually going to make the situation happen faster. The situation will all of a sudden last for three minutes only, or three hours straight, depending on how long you are shouting but you can go megaphones at the same time yeah what is the megaphones made of how does it create a sound and if you talk if all of them scream at once guys this feels just any other right of course situations could happen colors to change Everything you see around you has to change like you've never seen it before. It's in the same shape. Things go in the shade of red, blue, green, orange, purple, yellow, 